Welcome back at my channel. This is Katty, and today I prepared a very interesting position for you and also a bit complicated. So if you want to take some time to figure out what's the solution, take your time. You can simply pause the video and continue when you find the solution. It is white to move. You can see the position on the screen. Uh, black has a queen or rook and two pieces. But black's piece coordination is not that fast. And also, white's bishop on h7 and rook on g6 are hanging. So here you can find the best moves and white can win this position. Let's see now the solution. White goes with rook e6. White sacrifices a rook on e6. Black can capture this rook with king or with a pawn. If pawn takes, then knight g6, and there is a fork, and white has two extra pieces. So let's see what happens if king captures. Now we have d5. King has e7 and d6 squares. If king comes on d6, then knight f7. Once again, we're winning the queen. So king has to come on e7, and now white is a move. If you find this move, then well done. d6 is the winning move. King cannot capture for the same reason, knight f7 and loses a queen. If king comes forward on e6, here it is stuck and after bishop f5, now black is forced to take on d6. And we know already the answer for white. All right, let's see now what happens if king goes backwards on e8. There is a d7. Uh, king has to come on e7. If king goes on d8, then once again we have this fork. So king e7, and now it is final uh, move that white can do. This is a d8 queen. And no matter what black plays, black loses a queen. And this game is of course winning for white because of extra bishop. There is a beautiful line after king f8. Now if white pushes d7, then black can capture the bishop with a um, check and gets out of these pinning variations. King will come on e7, will stop the spawn and it's winning for black. So instead of this, here white has a winning move. You can once again pause the video and find it by yourself. Well, the move is g6. This pawn guards the bishop. Black cannot capture this for knight g6 fork. Um, well, after this, um, it is hard to make any move for black. Let's see what happens if f6. Then we have d7. White wants to promote the pawn to queen. So black plays king e7 to stop it. And now it's final. Um, move for white which wins a queen for sure d8 queen and no matter what black responds black will lose this queen knight c6 knight e8 and of course this position is winning with one extra bishop do let me know in the comments if you got this puzzle right and we will meet each other in the next video